Okay, I'm here at the trailhead for Mount Lorne outside of Whitehorse. From what I can tell, it looks like a pretty straightforward day of a nice ridge loop, including the peak, and uh, hopefully no bushwhacking, although that's not a guarantee. Sometimes there's more adventure than you expect. That's all right, adventure is what I love. Okay, I'm here at the old trapper's cabin. Here is where the trail makes a fork and the ATV trail keeps going straight. I'm gonna make a left and go up to the first peak from here. Come on, girl. I'm now up at the first peak on the ridge. From here, the views really open up all around. It gets quite beautiful. There's a couple snow patches left. We'll see what this ridge holds for us ahead. Now we have to lose a bunch of elevation to go down across this saddle and then straight up again all the way to the main summit. I think we passed the most technical part. I think the first part of the ridge had a little bit of hands on and I had to boost Nina. We had to give the dog boost up and over a ledge. But after this, the ridge looks pretty fun. This cool little slot. And just like that, we're past all the scramble parts of the ridge behind us. We just have to cruise down and uh, look for this ATV trail on the way out. All the way down there. Now it'll just be a walk in the park. After you descend from the ridge, you have quite a long walk over this open tundra-like landscape with no trees. And this walk just goes on and on as you loop around to the main trail, still far below me. 
So total distance today was 23.5 kilometers, which is a pretty hefty distance. You definitely feel it in your legs at the very end. And it's a very long, monotonous trail. So I'd almost bring a bike next time. But the ridge itself is a lot of fun. A few hands-on moves, great views all around. And uh, this is a pretty fun hike close to Whitehorse. Stay curious and have fun. Thank you.